Meeting the Lady of the Forge really brought back some memories. I thought it was only in my homeland you'd see such things. Mermaids who forge weapons. Aye. I remember very fondly a late nymph called Nimue. Very talented with a sword. Maria. I meant that literally. Shame on you. She made the best swords in all the Isles and had big dreams about what she'd do with them one day. I wonder what became of them. That rune slate's incomplete. Think we could finish it? Now, the word. Mecky. <sighs> Success. The gate is lowering out there. a very loud horn, and I've not the faintest idea. Mimir. No, truly. No one knows where the Gallahorn originated. Odin just gained possession of it one day. battle that grave will provide. Father, I failed you. Speak, spirit. Is that? Father, I can't see you. I wasn't quick enough. I'm so sorry I abandoned you. Your father is dead. What? How? He went to find the other treasure on his own, to spare you the dangers. It seems that in your efforts to protect one another, you each came to one of these islands on your own, and... I've been such a fool. But thank you, thank you, for telling me. Perhaps now we can see each other again. What a shame. In their attempt to spare the other, they both perished. There is a lesson there. What now? We will retrieve the treasure, then return to the father. 
What for? To finish what he and his son started. That water wheel's getting no water. I see. The geyser under the water wheel is blocked. <laughs> Something appears to be atop that island. Perhaps the treasure the spirit spoke of. We could use that lift, but not while it's up there. down, but it has to stay that way. Quite the cash. I see why it meant so much to our lost treasure seekers. Perhaps we should go tell the father what became of his son. <laughs> I 
net. Ah, uh, lungs. Stop all that rubbish. What? Brock's bloody riddle. What gets bigger the more you take away? I can't let that blue twat beat me. If you are this upset, he already has. Did you make the spear? Wait, no. Brock has to be the one to tell me what happened. I'm just gonna pretend I was never here. Something else I recall about that great play I mentioned, if you won't take offense at a critique. As a work of performance, it consisted almost entirely of watching people give speeches and receive terrible news. Might have been nice to see more events dramatized instead of described. It is Greek tradition for a story to unfold in a single time and place uninterrupted. It is more clear. If you say so. You're back. We have news of your son. Oh, please, please, tell me. He died trying to find the other treasure. He didn't know you were doing the same. No, no, no. This is my fault. He disobeyed your wishes. Yes, because that is what sons do. I should have brought him with me. We'd be alive and rich beyond all reason together don't blame yourself he is at peace nevertheless thank you for finding him i'll seek him out in Helheim. i'm glad we did this kratos yes and i'm sure atreus will be as well yes gets bigger the more you take away. Nothing. Uh, I don't think so, brother. Hmm. I do not like riddles.
Come on, Kratos, get up! Master Kratos, a spectacular job. Keep it up and you'll become an expert in no time. I can't tell if he was patronizing or if that was just plain sad. Both. Brother, you don't like riddles, eh? No. Oh, you just haven't heard any good ones. Here, I'm tall when I'm young, short when I'm old. What happened? A candle. Yeah. Heard that one before? No. Oh. Well, did you like it? No. Headed back to the city?
I came by and took out an Ainher Yard patrol. Area should be clear. Can't speak for the rest of town. Guess an occupying army is as good as a lockdown for tamping down foot traffic. You're back to clean up the mess that extra head of yours made. We have done it. Doesn't fix what I did, but hopefully it makes things a bit better. Let's be off, brother. Your hammer. Thanks! Might not mean much with Odin's goons stomping around the city, but folks see this and they'll know we haven't completely given up. Not yet. <laughs> Never expected to see this thing again. Derwin. Kratos! Sorry about earlier. Talking about your wife like that. Do not be. No! Let me apologize. Feeling your father's spear in your back makes a man want to set things right. Your silence on the matter is enough. Ah. If you say so. You spoke of resistance. Instead, you drink. Oh, I've got plans that you know nothing about. Coming together as we speak. Meantime, I don't plan on my soul parts floating to Alfheim Stone Cold sober. When the Aesir run me through, I'd rather be too hammered to feel it. You are staring. You're a tough man not to stare at. If the dwarves had your strength, Odin would have never gotten as far with this place as he did. My strength has little to do with my body. Yeah, sure. Derlin. Are you to thank for the newfound fresh air sliding up our nostrils? We turned off the mining rigs. So you did. Let's pretend you did so in a manner consistent with the 97 part safety regulations handbook written specifically for the operation, maintenance and deactivation of said mining equipment. Do what you will. Hmm. Well, thanks anyway. Means a lot. Well done. Though I don't suppose more violence in the streets will convince the citizenry that it's safe to emerge. A riddle. If you fancy a boot to the head. Riddle solved.
Did you make the spear? Wait, no. Brock has to be the one to tell me what happened. I'm just gonna pretend I was never here. 